Yay. <laughs> I didn't ever have a dream dress or a dream wedding that I was gonna have. I like this because we did actually like the halters. Yeah, pretty. I just want to find something that's beautiful and perfect for me. Hello, who's Hi. Jennifer, my bride? I'm right here. Nice Hi. to meet How are you. you? Welcome Wonderful. to Kleinfeld. Thank nice you to so meet much. you. Who did you bring with you today? Um, this is my fiance, Peter. Hi, Hi. Peter. How are you? And this is actually Peter's wife, Ellen. <laughs> We're a polygamous okay. couple. Yeah. Yeah, like, Hi, nice you? Okay, so now I'm like a little bit confused. Sure. So tell me about that. Sure, so they've been married for 10 years. Wait, wait, wait. You're married? Uh, yes, we, we are, are married. Them. You're married. And they are getting married. Yeah. <laughs> so it's gonna be the three of you? Yeah. Yes. yes. So um, Ellen had some serious health issues which yes. put a strain on their relationship and marriage. Right after I had my daughter, um, I started having um, symptoms I didn't know at the time. It was obsessive compulsive disorder. One of my main symptoms was um, I could not deal with touch. That, of course, affects intimacy, and I had full recognition of that. I thought that was quite unfair to him. So I decided to let Peter have, a, you know, the option to be with someone else. I never wanted to embarrass Ellen. I never wanted people that don't understand, that don't understand all the details of our life, you know, to know about. Um, that was lonely. This isn't really a religious base as far as um, we were all Catholic. Um, you know, clearly pretty far from, uh, you know, the religion in which we were raised. You have to understand this is something that I kind of pushed. I wanted to be sure that he was okay. How did you meet the groom? Uh, we met online, we met on Seeking Arrangements. So we met in January of this year. We just hit it off immediately. When we were dating, he would always call, text, bring me flowers. We fell in love right away. He was perfect, and he still is. <laughs> when is the big day? We're getting married July 17th, 2017. Beautiful, beautiful date. Who else do you have with you? Sure, I have my good girlfriend, Tishy. Hi, Tishy, how are you? Very nice to meet you. And this is Stephanie. Hi, Great Stephanie, how are you? you? Yes. Do you have any ideas as far as what you're looking for in dresses? Yeah. Um, I and like... is it okay to have this conversation in front of We can have the, the conversation, girl. but he's not going to stick around when I <laughs> okay. try on. Okay, okay. Um, I like A-line. I don't really like strapless. I no? want to be a little bit more modest and covered okay. up. Okay. Just something more traditional, classic. Classy, beautiful. Is there any price point that you feel comfortable um, in? Yes, I want to keep it between like two to three thousand. I don't really want to go above that okay. because I don't want it to be the main expense of our wedding. Okay, you mm -hmm. got it. Are you ready to try on some dresses? I'm so ready to try on Good. dresses. Okay. Well, it was very nice to meet you. Likewise. And best of luck to you. I'll see you guys in a few hours. Okay. <laughs> Come on, let's go try some dresses on. I never would have imagined Jen in a polygamous relationship. It seems like it kind of works out for their situation, you know. I'm not here to judge. Yeah. You know, I'm just here to support her and mm -hmm. all of their decisions, so. <gasps> oh! <laughs> so funny. Oh. Yay. Isn't that beautiful? Yes, I love this dress. It even looks more beautiful out here, right? Yeah, I love it. This dress is beautiful. It's something I imagined myself in. I love the lace. I love the sleeves. I love the details. It's definitely very me. What do you think? I love it. I really like the sleeves on that, too. Ellen, how do you feel about the dress? It's absolutely beautiful. Maybe I'm an anomaly. I, I'm not, I haven't been incredibly jealous or anything through this process. Strangely enough, I, it's heartwarming. Uh, so I said, maybe I'm an anomaly. I don't know. <laughs> do you think that Peter will like it? Oh my gosh, yes. He likes everything I do. Okay, yeah. that's good. <laughs> The dress is a little bit heavy. I'm having a beach wedding, so I love the dress, but I don't know that it's perfect for my big day. We do have a few other dresses in the room. Okay. So I think we will try them on. Come on. Okay, so nobody liked this one. Yeah, it Too went. Too much dress. Yeah, it okay. went as expected. Yes, it did. I have one more dress in the room. It's a strapless mermaid dress. And I actually think that this dress is going to be beautiful on her, and I think it's going to be sexy and fabulous. I like this one a lot. Isn't that gorgeous? Yes. 
It is so your shape. In this dress, I feel like myself. I feel beautiful. I am in love with this dress, and I can't wait to show everyone. Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous? Yes. That's pretty. Look at you, you're posing and everything yes, in this one. I love this one. That's sexy. <laughs> I love the sequins. I love that lace underneath. It complements my body, and I just feel young. I feel sexy. I feel beautiful. Do you want to see what the ladies think? Of course. Okay. Well, I mean, this is the body language. And I mean, look at her. I mean, you could see how much she loves I love it. This. And it's strapless. I didn't want strapless, and it's mermaid. but hello. And you didn't want strapless or mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens, you know? You don't know to get tried on. Do you guys love it? Oh my god, I love it's gorgeous. It. Yeah. I love it. You think the groom is gonna love it? Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh no hesitation. <laughs> I know it may be it's surprising. I'm seeing her trying on wedding dresses to marry my husband, but I see the way he looks at her. And he absolutely, they both absolutely love each other. Do you think you're gonna wear a veil? <laughs> yes. Would you like to try one on? Yes, please. Okay, I'm gonna get you one, okay? Talk about bringing out your figure. I mean, that yeah. one. <laughs> I'm obsessed. Dorothy. What are we doing? Come here, come on, look at this. What dress is this? Listen, look at me. It's strapless. Okay. And it's mermaid, two things see. she didn't want. Look at her. It's gorgeous, right? Right. Okay, no peeking, you have to look at okay. that Okay, yay. <laughs> The girl's are gonna see you first. Okay. <laughs> oh. You look like you wanna cry. Yeah, I How do you so feel? Oh. Here. <laughs> you do look beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> baby. making it more real for you? Yeah, it is definitely. Hey, it's wonderful. Because it, it's what adds her to our family. <laughs> it was emotional. Uh, Ellen cried, I cried. They were tearing up. I mean, I, it just felt so real, and that was the best part of the day. Do you want to turn around and see how, you, how beautiful you look in the veil yes. as well? Yes. Do you love it? I love it. So can you see yourself going down the aisle? Absolutely. In this dress? I can't wait. So Jennifer, are you saying yes, yes. to the dress? Yes. <laughs> Yay! I wish for them to have a long and happy marriage. Mm. I do realize it's out of the norm. It's like uh, maybe jealousy will come from time to time. It's a natural human reaction. But the thing is, is that you just kind of work through it, uh, if that's what you want. I love it. I love it. And you can't show any pictures to Peter. This is going to be yeah. a surprise, right? Yeah. yeah. I don't think he needs to be surprised. <laughs> Finding the dress symbolizes for our family that we're really coming together after our wedding ceremony. It's permanent, it's real, and we're all in this together forever.